Have you ever built any Android application and do you want to earn money with it? So this video is for you. Hey everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. My name is Chirag Vaishnav and in this video we will have a look at 7 best ways to earn money from your Android application. So do watch till end and let's get started. With application development industry comes a huge potential of making millions of dollars. And in present scenario, Android is the most widely used operating system and is being used globally. As a result of which, a lot of users are getting started with it each year. As a result, there are a lot of opportunities for Android developer. A lot of MNCs and startups have regular openings for them. Also, if you are having a brilliant startup idea, you can provide your service to others by implementing your idea to application. In 2020, Google Play users worldwide downloaded 108.5 billion mobile apps and many more are expected to enter the domain. This simply states that there is a tough competition for generating revenue from your application. And in such competitive world, you can save your application from sinking by focusing on the right points before jumping directly into the development. So let's start with the point that you must consider if you want to earn money from your application. The first we are having is sponsorship. It is one of the best ways to monetize your applications as in this we app developers can generate our revenue without disturbing the user experience. And in this we can directly get in contact with the brands according to our application. Also getting starting with the revenue model is not that tough. You have to just connect the company that can sponsor you and also make sure the company is having the same target audience as your application as it will increase the chance of getting you sponsorship. Second we are having advertisement. While your application is free to download, but you can still make money out of it based on the interactions with the advertisement displayed on our application. Like for websites and blogs, we are having Google AdSense with help of which we can integrate advertisement to our website and earn money out of it. Similarly for application, we are having a service provided by Google only named as Google AdMob. With Google AdMob, we can integrate advertisement to our application. With this, we can help grow some business along with engaging audience. This app revenue model is highly considered as it is really profitable. The in-app advertisement have platforms like video advertisement, native advertisement, banner advertisement, text advertisement, etc. And the third interesting way can be referral marketing. In this way, we can promote a third party product or service in order to optimize our revenue opportunities. App publishers can sell or promote their product based on the number of clicks or installations. There are different kind of referral marketing that app publishers follow. In this first we are having CPA that is cost per action. We can earn money from this by advertising or promoting the product in the form of pop-ups in our application. Next we are having CPC that is cost per click. In this we can generate the revenue depending on the number of clicks on the advertisement displayed in our application. And based on the similar strategies you can have cost per view, cost per install and a lot lot more. And by this way, you can generate a good revenue from your free application. Fourth in the list, we are having crowdfunding. It is a good alternative method of generating revenue for our application as it is used a lot nowadays being a good method to monetize your application for free. Here you can exchange your app ideas or publish MVP versions on platforms like Kickstarter or Crowdfunder in order to raise the fund for your application. As per statistics on Kickstarter platform, 138 app ideas were funded between 10k to 100k US dollars. Also in 2017, a Hello Earth app with a famous cat character earned 148,000 US dollars with similar monetization strategies. The fifth strategy that comes to our mind while thinking of how to monetize our application is subscription model. In this, you have to charge some amount of money from your users in order to provide a premium or special feature of your application. In this, you can provide your application for free either with some limits or hiding some of the features which you can access only after you buy a premium or a subscription. This model is nowadays more practiced in video streaming platforms like Netflix or Amazon Prime and user will definitely buy your subscription if you are providing a valuable and a premium content. Sixth we are having is paid application. If you are having a service or a resource that is not available on any of the free platforms or if available it is not as the same quality content as you are providing on your application resource then you can use this revenue model. For example, an ebook. In this, you have to take one time payment from the user, and after that, he or she will be able to access your resources and your services. And in order to make your paid application successful, keep in mind that you are providing a quality and good content at a reasonable price so that more customers can come and tag along watching the value of your content. Seventh in the list, we are having physical services. So, in the present scenario, when people like services to be at their doorstep, 
we can make applications which provide physical services and make good revenue out of it. In this, you can provide services that user wants. And if you did it perfectly, they are for sure gonna pay you. For example, you can provide services like an electrician, plumber, or a property dealer and a lot, lot more. So these were the seven ways by which you can earn money from your Android application. I hope it was helpful. So this was it for today's video. If you're having any doubt regarding whatever I have explained in this video, so do ask in the comment section. I will for sure answer it. Also, you can refer to a lot of articles on Geeks for Geeks website regarding the projects. So do like this video, subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching.